Hey all, it's Arka, and I'm back with another video. Now, <laughs> I know, a new look. Uh, I have these glasses. It's because, uh, it's computer glasses. You would have known that if you saw my Instagram post. Go follow me there, because why not? Anyways, let's do the video. So, just yesterday, Windows 11 was leaked. Uh, surprising, right? I also- that's also surprising to me, because I thought they were gonna- Microsoft was gonna finish on Windows 10. But what do you know, there's a Windows 11, and I downloaded a virtual machine of Windows 11 already, and I have it here already. I don't know how this is going to work. We're going to turn it on right now, and we're going to see timeout. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know what that did. <laughs> I don't... Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. It's doing something. Um... It's doing something, I think. Okay, I've been trying to look up how to release the mouse button. Haha, <laughs> we got it booting. All right, install now. I hope it doesn't just install Windows 10 because this is a Windows 11 ISO. I don't know if I'm going to put a download yet in the description. Uh, ooh, product key. Okay, so we're just going to abandon the uh, product key. I don't have a product key. Will it let me? Ah, there we go. Yes, let's just install Windows 11 home. I guess we're just gonna do custom Wow, they copied Windows files extremely fast. I don't think I've seen any virtual machine install as fast as that just did Or copied files as fast as that did um, Anyways, this is going to take a bit of time. So I'm either going to time-lapse this or skip it. So well, that was actually a very quick installation. It's literally been like a two, three minutes already. And it's it already finished every it's practically done. Hey. I hate that it's not in full screen, but whatever. Is this right country? Yes, I'm totally America. Okay. Alright, so we're the setup so far, I'm liking it. Like, I just based off the images, I was already liking what Windows 11 looked like, but now I'm actually doing it now, and it's. I'm liking it. Let's add your account. Ooh. What if I don't want to? Okay, I'm gonna find. I have to sign into a Microsoft account, but of course, cutting this out. Choose settings, location. I don't need any of that. Diagnostic, sure. You know what? I don't care. This isn't an actual computer. Give Microsoft all my information. Big Brother Microsoft deserves it all. <laughs> oh, made a noise. Oh, almost there. Hey. Okay. First thing, 1920 by 1080. All right. And hey, keep changes. All right, so so far I'm liking it. So far, I'm liking it. They have the taskbar in the middle. Very, very cool. They still have this garbage and this garbage. So, let's see what we got here so far. So, it automatically... Oh, I like that font. Let's see. So, it automatically puts the time. Notification. I like the sounds as well. I like them more than the Windows sounds. So, this just looks like a, a Windows 10 build or whatever. I like this background, though. There's a lot of it that I like. Uh, I have to get used to the middle. Ooh, that's an interesting start menu. That That's a lot. Okay, so <laughs> Windows 11, it pretty much just looks like Windows 10 with the skin. Like, I'm pretty sure... Okay, that's a weird icon for that. The hell is this? What did I press? Widgets. Okay, that's something new. Ooh, there's an aerial flood watch here. I also have to censor that, which is, um, not good. That's a new thing. I like that. Folders, let's see how much different this looks. I like those icons. Okay, I do like those icons, but I kind of also like the old thing that was established, like, several Windows versions ago. Like, it doesn't look bad, but... Ooh, the those folders. <laughs> those folder icons. Ooh, they're really giving me, a like... Linux kind of feel okay, but at least I like how Microsoft here is going for like less of a Oversimplification that a bunch of things have been doing recently. They're adding gradients to stuff They're adding gradients, which is good because I'm tired of having no gradients on stuff 
Edge just as garbage as usual, I think. Welcome to the new Microsoft Edge, a fast, safe, productive web browser that works for you. No, it doesn't. It does not work for me. I want Chrome. Where's Chrome? How do I Chrome? No, shut up. I don't care about releasing input. All right. All right. Complete setup. Whatever. What? Why do you need... Why do you need this? Anyways, let's see what website uh, is automatically put in. Don't care, don't care. Okay, that's fine. Don't care, don't know what that is. Don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care. All right, this is totally useful to me. Solitaire, we have to try Solitaire. You can't have a Windows version without Solitaire. This looks about the same. This looks exactly the same as Windows 10. This looks... And I win! This is the first time I played Solitaire in like three years or something, and I already won. I am impressed that I could still <laughs> beat Solitaire. Uh, Alright, let's just... I guess we'll just finish off the, uh, the game then. Hit me with that classic Solitaire ending. Hey. <laughs> Uh, channel with mostly games. Of course, you have to get games in here somehow. I think the only thing that's new is like new interface stuff. Like, look at that task manager, though. Yeah, but like it basically looks exactly the same. It's mostly just new icons and stuff. Uh, little things to make uh just everything a bit better, I guess. So yeah, if you're looking for Windows 11 uh experience, it's just new looks, really. Nothing surprisingly new that's like right in front of your face like the only thing that i could see that's new that's right in your face is the user interface which would make sense it's a new version of windows nearly every version of windows has had a user interface update windows 10 wasn't much from windows 8 but windows 11 ain't much from windows 10 so <laughs> netflix just got installed you know i really like those sounds i think i'll actually all right if i go to if i go to the drive um, I believe if I I can get the sounds of Windows, I believe I can extract. I believe I can get the sounds uh, and download them somehow from here. All right. So so far, there's nothing really much to look at Windows 11. What we have was just leaked yesterday, and there's no planned release date for Windows 11. But I do know that Microsoft is going to be talking about something new about Windows. Um, in just like a week or two from now on the 24th of June so if this video I mean if I'll, I don't know if I'll make a Windows 11 sounds video I might I, I probably will make a make a sounds video most likely if I mean either you get this video to like 10 likes or something because I know not many people actually leave likes on my videos 10 to 15 likes if you know, set it to 15 15 likes and I make a Windows 11 sounds video or comment down below if you want me to do that and I'll probably do that so that was my short review of Windows 11 so far I like it and I would probably use it uh, it would probably take a bit of time in order to get used to the layout and everything of it so pretty good so far thank you guys for watching comment like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video remember to comment down below and to get this video to 15 likes if you want me to do a windows 11 sounds video goodbye